Um, we've been keeping the tempo high, getting after each other and everything, and just trying to be the best that we can be every day. Caleb, how, you hear as you go around that this defense is uh, probably the best in Southeastern. Do y'all do y'all take any stock in that, or y'all just kind of shove that aside and go out and play? Nah, no, so we shove that aside. You know, we don't go out with the big head. We just go out every day trying to get better. You know, we we always realize that you know, no matter how good we are, there's always room for improvement. Even Coach Roberts has said that our offense is this is the best defense our offense is going to see all year. Yeah, yes, sir, definitely. And our offense is probably the best offense we'll see all year, also. You know, that's probably why, you know, we'll contend for a national championship this year. After four practices, it seemed toward the end there, like in session 29 and 30, things start to get a little chippy today. People were talking. Uh, is, is, that, is that good? Oh, yeah, that, yes, sir. That's great. You know, no, normally we started, you know, we get that starter around period 10 or 11, you know, but tonight we came out a little bit flat because, you know, we got rained out and everything yesterday. But we try to keep the tempo as high as we can all the time. For you, what's it like to be back on the field? Uh, everybody knows your story. Uh, you went down last year and you rehabbed all, all off season. Uh, what's it like to be back on the field for you? It, it's great. You know, I, I look at it as another opportunity that God gave me to, you know, come out and play a great sport, you know, and I come out every day and never take it for granted and try to work my butt off. Four linebackers uh, on the all-conference team, first team all-conference, in, in a linebacker set that only three can play at one time. <laughs> Talk a little bit about that. Yeah, yes, sir. That's, um, Coach Rob takes a lot of pride in, you know, playing as many guys as he possibly can, you know, and as long as, our, you know, a, a backup is pushing the starter, you know, that makes us just that much better. So, yeah. What's that like? I've always wanted to ask that question. Uh, you know you're not going to get all the snaps in a game. You're going to roll in, you're going to roll out, you're going to roll in, you roll out. Well, is it easy to get in the flow of a game like that? Uh, I mean, at, at times, yes, sir. But we just look at it as in when we are in, you know, we have to go 100%, you know, because we know we won't get as many chances as, you know, another guy in the conference. But with that opportunity, we, you know, they're playing at 80% in the fourth quarter. We're playing at 110%. So being a local guy, is uh, this season going to be special for you? Yeah, yes, sir, definitely. You know, my, my last season here in Hammond, getting to play in front of my family and friends, you know, it, it'll be a great one, though. It's going well. You know, obviously, like they say, Rome wasn't built in a day, so uh, it's a continual process. Uh, we're getting better, taking steps forward, uh, and getting the new guys acclimated, getting the old guys, you know, back in the groove of things. So it's, it's going well so far. Everywhere you go, and even from the head coach, you hear that uh, when he talks to the offense, he goes, guys, this is the best defense you're going to face all year. Yeah, yeah. Uh, talk a little bit about that and, and having the defense that you have. Well, uh, you know, obviously, we, we, we have expectations very high in our meeting room. Uh, you know, we set the standard pretty high in our meeting room. Uh, so there's no, there's no you know, secret about that. Uh, but in the same token, as much as they talk about you know, facing the best defense, uh, we really feel like we face the best offense every day in practice. So you know, iron sharpens iron, and uh, we love what we see in practice as far as competition, uh, and only gets us better. Uh, four first-team all-conference linebackers mm. uh, in, in a set where you normally you play three at one time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, obviously, that's due to the fact that the way y'all roll guys in and out. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's, Got to feel good to know that you got four first-team All-Conference linebackers. Well, I, I think the key word to that is preseason. You know, so obviously that means we have the potential to have some very good players, uh, but we'd much much rather have postseason 
uh, all conference players in preseason. So uh, it's a goal, it's an expectation, uh, it's a standard, and uh, you know we're going to live up to that. A local guy, uh, you get back this year, uh, Caleb Muse. Yeah. Talk a little bit about him and his off season to get back to where he is today. He looks really good. Yeah, yeah. Caleb is a is a guy who's going to be a great addition back to the defense. Uh, if you, I don't know if you can tell or not, but we kind of missed him uh, last year. Uh, so having him back, he's a smart, intelligent, you know, workhorse type kid. Uh, so obviously he's going to be an addition to the defense that you know hopefully he's going to add to us, which I think he will. I think he will. And on the back end. Uh, you look at it on paper, and like you said, it's preseason. But you look at it on paper, it's like you're like, wow, the the possibilities are endless. What, oh, yeah. what, what about that position? Oh yeah, well we no doubt about it, no secret. We got some talent. Uh, I'm not gonna hide that one bit. Uh, but not only do we have talent, we have competition. You know, so competition in the back end is only gonna make practice better because you know those guys know that I can't take a rep off because that guy behind me is just as good as me. Uh, he's chomping at the bit, but it's good competition. You know, it's only making each other better and making practice better. As the defensive coordinator, you got 20 days till Jacksonville. What's the most glaring concern for you? What do you want to see happen between now and the next 20 days before y'all tee it up on August 30th? Oh man, the biggest concern, the most glaring uh, thing I want to see us get better is tomorrow. I want to step out in the practice field, watch the film from tomorrow, come back out here tomorrow, and get better. So we take it day to day, day to day. You know, one time, uh, one day at a time. Uh, and obviously that's tomorrow, so we'll watch the film uh, and come back out here and get better.